takes its bank and it floods over me. Oh my Lord, won't you come and carry me? I come from a family of eight boys and uh, no, we're not Amish, we're not Catholic. Um, just <laughs> That was good stuff. Why are you laughing? I'll do it again. I'll fly away, oh glory. I'll fly when I grew up, we were going to a little church in Aldergrove, BC. My older brother Jeremy was the worship leader, and uh, I just idolized him. And so I, I snuck his chord chart away one night and, and grabbed his guitar and that was my start in music and I just kept learning. Bless the Lord, oh my soul. I eventually started a band and started writing music and the band I was in, you know, we started getting some success and people started coming to our shows which was really cool and then and we ended up uh, signing to Madonna's Maverick Records and I thought at that point that my life was made that I was going to be maybe the next U2, I didn't know. We toured around with Maverick, we had a song climbing up the Billboard charts, and then we lost our deal in 2004. When the deal fell through, I kind of ended up in a place um, where I didn't, I didn't know what I was supposed to do with my life and where I was supposed to go. I got a call from a friend who I've been playing with and uh, he said, you have, you have an opportunity to go to Africa. And I immediately turned him down because I did not want to go to Africa. Uh, eventually, I went. I kept hearing this voice inside of me telling me to go. And the things I saw in Africa um, opened my eyes, I guess, and changed my perspective on not only my life, but my my role with music. Every bit of light had been stripped away. I could feel the beating hearts, yearning souls, the cry of I just think of the journey that God's taken me on um, through uh, dreams, broken dreams, disillusionment, um, and finding peace in the most unexpected of places in Africa and finding a uh, calling there. And that's what I hope to do with this gospel record is just to connect people's heads with their heart and um, just inspire them and point them to the cross. Make 